Hey, what's going on, everyone? It's your man, Just Jay Sama, one of the hosts of the Canon Culture Podcast. Welcome back to another episode. If this is your first episode, make sure to follow all the instructions about following everybody on their social medias, and make sure you also give this podcast five stars if you're listening on Apple iTunes. Um, subscribe to it if you're listening to it on Spotify or any other pl- streaming platform, whatever whatever you're listening to this crap on. Um, anyway, this week we get into some more nerd stuff. We know how you guys love the nerd stuff, and then we also get into some pretty serious topics as well for this week. Um, we hope you guys enjoy. Thank you so much for listening. Let's go ahead and get into it, guys. Um, so this first thing that we're going to talk about, because I feel like this would be short, sweet, and to the point, um, and this is really something that DJ's into. Um, Trick Daddy was on the Drink Champs podcast, right? I think it was the Drink Champs podcast. And uh, he was talking about how, uh, yeah, he get, his, he get his booty eaten, okay? And uh, hold on, let me play the clip. When you say women to support the eat booty game, you're yeah. saying women is eating the booty? Yeah, women oh, eat the booty on. juice. Wait, wait, what? Yeah. <laughs> I don't know whether to make noise for that or not. Yeah, I get eight out. <laughs> yeah, wait, wait, what? He said, yeah, I get <laughs> eight out. Mean? I get eight out. Hey, listen, man. Check this out. All right, quick. You don't have your legs in the air, man. It depends. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> we don't even think about it. When you say... <laughs> See, I, what, what made me lose it was when dude goes he said you don't have your legs up in the air sir i was like hamstrings to your to your ears <laughs> put the knees in in the fetal position all right now listen i i'm not somebody who has an issue with that um it's not something i request at all but you know <laughs> if uh you put enough casamigos in my drink i might i might uh Ain't no way. <laughs> I'm like, you said what? I'm like, Ain't no way. No way. I'm like, Ain't no way. Nine shots. You know, I found out that you my limit. Sick, you are a sick right? individual. I found out that my limit was eight <laughs> to keep me conscious. So I think at nine, I you just I think it's over. I think it's over for me. Nine shots you, you in, I'm done. Your horizons? Nine shots in, the cheeks are open. Nine shots why, in. That's when why, my knees why? are coming to my ears. Why? Yes, sir. Why? <laughs> just for free? <laughs> Do you huh? get anything out of it? I mean, why not? At, at, I'm gonna I'm gonna be honest with you. At nine shots of tequila, it, it, you better be careful because it's gonna come. Something's coming out of an end of me. I'm just letting you know that right now. Oh you my said, god! Huh? You oh holding on to a god. grenade in your hand and you don't know how long that pin has been pulled out. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> so <laughs> you might just be <clears throat> fucked. Jay, um, Jay. Listen, oh, listen. Okay, god. just because. Oh, no. First of all, just because you have an experienced. Okay, such such a magnificent treatment of your of your man parts. Okay, don't be judging. So you have. Don't be judging. First you, of all, you have. First of all, okay, you need to relax. Second, no, of all, I'm just judge. You're not gonna judge me for what I may or may not have done. I'm, I'm just I'm just asking. See, I'm just, it's just a question. You, you could tell. Know. You could tell he did it. What? I didn't. Do uh, no, I want, not, no, 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 no. Since, since <laughs> if Trick Daddy can get on a Drink Chance podcast, you can tell the people. Have you done it? Huh? Has what? Ha, have I done what? Huh? Have you done it? Have huh? I done what? Have I? You know what I'm talking about? Sir, no, I have asked, you had to I eat it? What the hell is that? Have you oh, spread your own well, cheat? Wait a minute. What? 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 Which are one you were asking, you replying to? Are you asking? Have I been violated before? No, I've never yes. been violated. I've never been violated, violated. Oh, man, huh? yeah, bro. Never. When you said not yes, not I got. Not. I almost passed out. See, I don't think you need to worry about what I'm doing. Okay, I think you need to worry. I worry about, about what you're doing every day. You know what? Don't tell that to Boozy. Uh, Don't you tell that to Boozy. See, all right, all right. That mean, how <clears throat> how come every time Lil Nas X breathes, that just upsets Boozy. Any type of game wanna... activity <laughs> whatsoever, okay? He'd be like, God, st- six o'clock in the morning, this man tweeting talking about I can't stand that goddamn Lil Nas. That X. was crazy. <laughs> that was crazy. No o'clock in the morning, he think about Lil Nas. Uh, bro, bro, rent free. I really rent think free. rent free. Rent free. I really think if you got somebody else's existence on your mind at 6:30 in the morning eastern time okay you need you need to be going somewhere man especially you think about homo erotic activity oh yeah <laughs> you, you down trouble. bad at 6 a.m. <laughs> down bad for another man at 6 a.m. I could not believe it that's just <laughs> I don't know. His Breakfast Club interview was hilarious, actually. If oh, if anybody ain't seen that, man, that was funny. I I was more concerned with this man is really just not <clears throat> putting two and two together. I really think he has some type of 
cognitive issue to where he just couldn't understand what he was saying would be offensive to somebody else or because i think the thing that got me the worst was when charlemagne was saying oh yeah you know you could i you know you could be seen as inciting you know violence against gay violence, people yeah by yeah. saying you know you want to run up on stage and beat him up or whatever and he tried to clarify that he would do it to you know a straight person who was going on stage getting naked and stuff like that he's like what about women he goes huh <laughs> yeah, oh, they tried was... to do the same thing with him and threesomes too. When they were talking about threesomes, he's... he was like, "But you know, it's the two girls." And he was like, "Oh no, that, we do that all the time." And he was like, "No, two dudes." And then Boozy kind of made this face, and I was like, <laughs> "Hey, well... you know what?" <laughs> Lil Nas X's re his response was hilarious too. He said, "Stop using your booger nose kids as an excuse. Just hate gay people with your whole chest." And I was dying. I was like, "Yo, I'm." Yo, if you hate gay people, just say that. That man. is, that That's is it. always like their reasoning for hating towards gay people. The, or the anything. children, they like, turn into the children, children gay. Think about the children. They it's turn like, into man, children gay. Your child is probably gay too. <laughs> all I'm gonna say is, your I played GTA, saw right? I've, and was like, I've played gun too. games all the time, <laughs> like, and I don't feel like shooting nobody. That's all I'm gonna say. So, Listen, I, the only thing that makes me violent about video games is when there's lag and I'm losing. That's it. That's it. Other than that, I mean, I'm not, I'm not, I'm truly not that violent most of the time, you know. So, I, uh, I'm gonna tell you, Mark, as, as the world continues to change and we continue to see things like this, this is just, this is just strange. At what point, let me ask you guys a question. At what point do you think we'll just be like publicly shunning, like everybody across the board, just shunning? racism homophobia and just like people like genuinely just not cutting it you know what i mean like you be out in public and you actually accidentally i mean somebody will probably say it accidentally one day you say maggot with the with the ph at the beginning mm. right you say it in public and mm. people just hey you can't do that you can't say that man what's wrong with you there's gay people in here you know what i mean <laughs> i don't i don't uh when uh, will we get to that yeah, point? I don't think we're gonna see it for we'll another. I don't think I don't, we'll we ain't gonna see that for a minute. I don't. Think we'll it, we ain't gonna see that for. I don't. If we ever get there, <laughs> yeah, I don't. Like I don't they would have to do something so fucking outlandish. Even like all the shit they've already done, they would have to do something like fucking wild to the point that like it changes. Like it's being taught in history. So. Well, they banned the MLK from the history books, so. Texas doing that too. Yeah, no, Texas, Texas is doing in, that too. But he's in Fortnite now. But he's in Fortnite. You know, <laughs> I don't think that was a good hey, idea, honestly. No, it was not. It yeah, was not. that's not a good idea. Oh, it's a. All right, it's class. Like, <laughs> We're gonna learn about the civil have, rights movement. Hey, that's the guy they, from Fortnite. <laughs> <laughs> they had, they had the Amazon woman emote, and her emote's like she whips, with her yeah. whip, and I was like, bro. What the fuck? Who's is this on the who? is this on the same weekend as the MLK thing? <laughs> we can, we can, this could be bad real fast. I was like, yo, like why y'all? Whose idea was this? this could get ben bad was the worst. This is no. Real fast, man. No, thank you. I think Whoever's in charge of their other team for that needs to be fired. MLK immediate. one's not it. They had they had sinks that said whites and colored. I was oh like, bro, in Fortnite? Yeah, in Fortnite. Yes, yeah, in Fortnite. Yeah, you guys seen the screenshots for it? That shit is oh rough, God. man. Oh, DJ. is I was, bro. I was like, Fortnite, probably not the place for that, dog. VR? For sure. Yeah, yeah, that's cool. V like a VR museum? Sure. Fortnite, yeah, no! Yeah, you know, or, or you know, like a little blurb, like a little message at the beginning. You know, we would like to honor Martin Luther King in the March on Washington. And that's it, you know, and have like a little mural in the background. That's it. Do you know the jokes that's about to fly? between these kids just off the sink thing alone like they're gonna be in the bathroom just cracking like no you gotta use that one that's the colored sink like that yep. type of thing is about to happen yep, yep. like i'm so it's, 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 it's coming it a is new, coming a new generation of racists see i don't think i could be a kid in this day and age man i don't think you could pay me <clears> enough oh, to not, go dog. back back to high school during this day and age no, because you're not a kid anymore. Nah, you have way too much information. I couldn't do it, man. I couldn't yeah. do it. There was, I mean, when I was a kid in school, we had the little flip phone thing. So me too. We we ain't had yeah. no. It wasn't no, no like, smartphone like kids, access kids to. Kids today will not stuff. realize 
how hard it was to like record a fucking ringtone like while wow. <laughs> someone was driving <laughs> bro like, shut the fuck up shut the fuck up I'm, I'm recording this shit start the song over man damn yeah start the song I'm trying cool to save part, this from stop. my voicemail jeez my, uh, they will never know. This is Tony. Leave a message after the. <laughs> <laughs> Are you trying to do my the fade out? My parents let me have like a CD <laughs> player. But they let me have like the one of the sliding phones. So the only way the I could ever was... the... yeah. Or so I don't know why I could have like a phone like that, but I couldn't have a CD player. So the only way I could have my own music whenever I wanted, I did have to like put it up against my speakers on my computer. And she had to yeah. record it and play it back later when yeah. she wanted to hear it. But it would song. only let me record up to a minute, so I had like multiple <laughs> just <laughs> sound clippings of songs, and it's like this is the only way I can listen to music. Imagine trying it to listen. Have, let me have a CD player, MP3 player, none of that. Imagine trying to like, listen been... to Outcast. Hey, yeah. <laughs> In one minute increments, part one and part Bruh. two. <laughs> Bruh. Hey, hey. Hold up. Hold yeah. up. <laughs> <laughs> oh Mainly going to the file on your phone and everything. Like, yeah. hey guys, don't worry. The party's not over. Just be sitting in class, just listening to that shit out loud. Uh uh. Uh no. This is. Ring toast starts happening. You start, everyone starts dancing. Ringtones was different back then, man. Oh, uh, ringtones was it? Do we even still back do then. ringtones anymore? I think most people usually just have like, Every default settings for everything. I think everyone yeah. just has either default settings or fucking on silent and vibrating. Because that's, yeah. that's I, don't, yeah, I don't even I, use ringtones anymore. Mm -mm. I, I don't. Mine's on silent all the time. Oh, we know. We know. I don't you. Wow. Well. Getting hit up all, all the time. That's what I'm. That's what I'm saying. You don't <laughs> respond to notifications. That's why. It's because you're not on Twitter, Selena. That's why. That's weird because she responded to me on Twitter. Huh? She did yeah. what? Damn. I think I responded like hours later, but I think it's because I was sleeping. Yeah. Oh, okay. Right. Yeah, I, I, still... I was like, oh, when's your birthday? She was like, uh, the 14th, I think she said. 13th. 14th? 13th. 13th. Oh, well, happy and... early birthday, Selena. Thank you. I'm buying you you were like almost two weeks early. Huh? So you were. I don't know when I'm going to see her again. So what? Exactly. Mind your business. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, my, I got my two 12-hour shifts okay. coming up. Mm. Happy See? birthday, Tony. Happy, Thank yes, you. happy early birthday, my friend. Thank you Three for coming happy back. We've missed you. Mm -hmm. Am I a variant? You what is what? happening here? I'm confused. I don't, know what universe, I don't know what universe I'm in right now. What, uh, slow down. Slow you, your roll. What happened? Speak English. I'm, English. I'm confused. I'm just confused. That's all. Can we not say happy birthday to people? It's like two weeks early. Merry Christmas. Shout Happy out. New Year. I haven't seen y'all in forever. I don't yeah. know if I'm back tomorrow. Oh, or that's three days. crazy. That's crazy. I yeah, what if, I can't, what if I don't that's see it. Tony that's on it, his DJ, birthday? That's your problem. You didn't get hugged enough. That's the problem. <laughs> you know, Excuse he might be right. Me, I he might be right. I'm a love child. Okay. Are you sure about that? What's that like? Allegedly. Mm. <laughs> Allegedly. <laughs> I would like to believe. So what if the, what if all my memories what if, are of what if things. I die before yeah, my birthday and Jay never got the chance to say happy birthday to me because I died. Listen. And y'all just go take this. He away said it me. now, so it's fine. Yeah, that's it. Well, that was I, very I, dark. Then when I'm at the eulogy, I could be like the last thing I ever said to Selena was happy birthday. So it'll it, at least be a pleasant, you know, hey, I didn't really get to say like, oh, Selena, you're so dope. You know, you're real, really great friend, blah, 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 blah. No, it was happy yeah, birthday. Yeah, she could be like. So then it could go to heaven and be like, like, oh, hi, Jesus. Oh, what was the last person to tell you something? Happy birthday. That's there nice. There we go. Come on, go to that heaven. That was really nice. Good. <laughs> that was really nice. I'm kidding. Go to hell. <laughs> oh, no. Take this poll right Shit, here. a little Nas X down there. We got a concert going. Wow. <laughs> Who's, right now, wow. as we're having this conversation. Is this concert playing on loop or something? As we're or? having this conversation, Boozy right now is just <laughs> Somebody must be talking about Lil Nas X and not disrespecting him. <laughs> this is this is some bullshit. <laughs> See, this is what's wrong with the kids nowadays. All right, it wasn't I'm this gay stuff. kids. <laughs> I want to protect the kids. Oh my god, bro! Speaking of protecting, we got kids. Pr kids. Uh, I think I think this really needs to be said. I think we really need to work on protecting people's feelings, and by that I mean. Y'all saw this video of this dude going up to Logan Paul and asking for a job. That man's an idiot. Wasn't it, like, didn't he quit like 
a job that like only one yep. percent of like, fucking uh, millennials <laughs> have. Yeah, uh, I think you say he was making a hundred thousand at twenty two or something Bro. like that. <laughs> I'd stab like, him. So somebody asked me to explain how this is white privilege, right? Somebody asked me to explain it. All oh. right, and I'll tell you how. Because to be twenty two years old. All right, and be making a hundred thousand dollars a year. You either have to know somebody, you have failed literally nothing in life because there's absolutely no way this man got here on his own. You know how I mm -hmm. know? Because he sat here and he told this man, Logan Paul, I have no friends, I have nobody backing me up. <laughs> He's like, Bullshit, you're a good looking guy. What do you mean you don't have any friends? He goes, I don't have nobody. I came here by myself. Like, I'm just, I'm so concerned with people's ability to see somebody who was clearly guided through life, his parents or somebody else set him up because there's absolutely no way you're getting out of college. You're still in college at 22, making a hundred thousand dollars a year. I can't feel sorry for you. I just can't. I absolutely. I've never can't. even seen a hundred thousand dollars. Yo, okay. bro, I can't even comprehend. Can't feel sorry for him off the fact that he quit that job and just went. Like, like you, like, you're gonna beg somebody <clears throat> to I, give you a job and then when you get in their face and they give you an opportunity to be like okay yo what are you good at you say tiktok dances and then he'd be like oh so you got to do sarcastically he says oh so you got it and then you say no you no no he that's said, not me oh so you got it like that he goes no not really yeah so what do you do what can you do like asking him like what his skills and shit was it genuinely looked like he would good he would give him a chance but the man he did. said, he... no, I'm not good at anything. And he's like, then why the fuck am I going to give you a job? They, that man literally looked yeah. at him like, the look in his eye was like, all right, let me hear this man out. What can he do? And he <clears> said, <throat> the answer that popped into his head you was know what? TikTok dance. You know what I just thought about? Why the fuck didn't that man just use PTO? Why he didn't just use the pay time off? Say I'm sick. I don't know. <laughs> I'm, I'm going, I'm, I'm sick. I got COVID. Let me take a couple days off nothing because he probably he probably thought because of where he's at it, he thought he probably quote unquote had it big or had it good and he can go there and just be like oh no i'm good i could just come get my job back whenever i get back imagine to the city. trying to explain to somebody that you are not special in any way shape or form and you deserve a job i mean like that's the majority of us though the the fucking audacity <laughs> like See, like and then, that alone. And then he got in the car and started crying. Like, bro, he got see, on TikTok and started crying. <laughs> see, I think, I think that like illustrates the perfect example of like the arrogance that young people have that think they can get whatever they want if they try. But like, dude had nothing of value, right? At all. And then like, proceeded all. to say, "I know there are millions of people trying to do exactly what I'm doing." This shit, this shit sent me, bro. He said, I know there are millions of people trying to do exactly what I'm doing right now, but I thought I would, Fucked and then said up. nothing, had nothing. He thought, <laughs> he thought he was special. He thought he was unique individual. He thought he was really built different. No, bro, sir. Take your ass bro, back to Ohio. Toast has more, has more personality than this man. This is, this is absolutely insane. I couldn't. Man. Uh, I, I, I stopped watching after that. I was like, I can't watch this. This is fucking terrible. <laughs> like, how the fuck do you expect to go to someone who's like fucking making it, like actually doing really well? And then you're like, yeah, I had a really good job and I quit because, I, you know, I want to work for you, but I, I have nothing special. Actor. I don't do anything. I don't do me. anything. Imagine I, quitting a I'm job. Legit, I'm, literal, I'm literal garbage. Uh, imagine me. quitting a job where you're making $100,000 a year because you want to struggle. Because Bro, you want just... you want to experience struggle for the first time, so you're like, you know what? God. I'm gonna quit my. I think job. I think he sees he saw the end the end result. Cause I was like I was watching this video right, and dude, you know it was like a uh, it's a guy on TikTok that does like random uh, haircuts or whatever. And I seen his video and dude crossed uh, this black dude like about forty something. He crossed him. He's like, yo, let me give you a cut. Like, let me chop it up with you, right? He was like, oh, no, we can, we can chop it up without you having to cut the hair. So they get to talking. And dude was like, if you can go back, what could you tell yourself? And then the grown man was like, to not worry about basically what Z is. Mm. People are so focused on, like, that whole alphabet, right? But the last letter. They want, they want the end result so fast that they don't even think about 
the grind and the hardships that people had to endure to even get to Z. They <clears> want to <throat> skip right from A and go straight to Z. That's probably what he was thinking. He was seeing him wanting to be an actor, him wanting to be a big time YouTuber, probably or whatever, like Logan is. Mm -hmm. And he was just seeing the end result. He he don't know what it took to even get to that point. So I'm gonna just pop up here, and since he made it already, I'm gonna be a Z with him. That's not how that worked. Uh, then he proceeded, you know, he proceeded to tell this guy. He said, "You know, I'm just trying to be like you. You know, you have a team around you, and you have you know people that you know." He's like, "When I started this, I didn't have nobody but my brother." Like mm -hmm. exactly. Like what the fuck? Yeah. <laughs> he started on uh, what was it? Uh, Vine. Is Vine. Yeah. yeah. He started on Vine making funny videos. Making then he. Videos. Uh, I think funny is debatable. Off. Yeah, that's not. <laughs> I mean, that's that's yeah, that's debatable. It was, you um, know, I, I really think I mean, clearly it was funny. Dude popped off. They make teenage nah, white children kids were his audience. They make teenage yeah. white kids happy. So yeah, I mean, teenage white man. kids will share your stuff all the time. It's everybody else who does. Like this is crazy. So it's I wonder, true. No, it's true though. Mm -hmm. It make, really is true. You make a teenage white kid laugh, they will take you into a Netflix deal. Look at King Bro, Patch. Do that. They'll go to they'll go to their school the next day and be like, yo, look at this shit. This shit is funny. Other pe other guys like Hispanics, they'll be like, nah. Eh. You'll get the yeah. share. You'll get the DM. Like if it's fun, if it's like <laughs> then I'll shit, I'll send it to Tony. Like if I find a TikTok that's funny, and I'll be like, oh, <laughs> Tony might like this. And send it to Tony. Tony don't even respond. He might double tap and like like him. That's how I know. He enjoyed that. He enjoyed that video. Yeah, yeah like it's, it's it really is like that. Like I don't care what it is. I don't care. Um ha 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 white white teenagers. <laughs> that's the market dog that's it that's the market my teenagers bro they will carry your shit into the stratosphere man listen man especially if they feel like they can connect with it too they be like hey, 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 look at this kid falling in the bathroom like <laughs> i don't know man <laughs> falling in the bathroom man, look at him falling in the bathroom trying to use the toilet <laughs> stupid <laughs> Jeez. oh my god man we we're going to hell we're, we're out to this whole planet it's a little planet, man. I can't. You know, I, I wonder if Homeboy with the with the job, if he he I wonder if he expected sympathy for what he was doing. Like, damn, you know, he did. I'll I... <laughs> he started with if I'm any... from Ohio. I, I, I would assume if, you trying to if relate any... to one of the Paul brothers. You tell him you're from Ohio, right? Oh, I, yeah. was ex I was expecting like maybe like oh, like maybe he'll he'll appreciate like the gutsiness of it, like the fact that i had the balls to do it but it's just like that's fiscally ir irresponsible bro why would you do that bro no backup plan whatsoever this is how mm -hmm. i knew you wasn't very smart how you making a hundred thousand mm -hmm. dollars a year yes, and you didn't be like maybe i should tuck some money away maybe i should like you know no 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 you know what jay you know what it is hmm. it's like he's gonna go back to his job and be like dad he didn't accept me all right <laughs> yeah son, <get> back <laughs> you know, that makes sense that's that makes it. a lot of sense that's probably flying business class. I feel comfortable up. putting because I could because I'll get my job back immediately because <laughs> oh my, my dad owns it. Yeah, actually, I'm really rich. Oh, <laughs> Did you can tell that? he wanted sympathy because he started anytime you get on the camera and start crying, you looking for sympathy. In my opinion, like my if you, if, it, if it happens, dollars a year. Like if somebody talking about something and it just happens that you crying, this man was beat red as soon as he turned the thing on, like. The man looked like an apple, and then I, like, I, he he looked like somebody had died in his wait, family. Wait, wait. That's how hard he was crying. Wait, wait, wait. Was the camera like this? Like I didn't get accepted. It guys. it was it was close. <laughs> it was close. Like he was like it literally. Would it would be like, like he was recording himself. Like it like was just right here. Yeah, like right oh, there. Like this? Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So then he would be like snot nose and everything. I could. Like, absolutely. Was my dream and I couldn't make it, but that won't stop me. Like, oh, shut the fuck up, bro. Ugh. No, he literally basically had that mindset because now he has his own fucking t-shirt that just says, can I have a job, uh, Logan Paul or some shit like that. You know that. what? I don't think he, he's going to think that far. Something tells me he's he's not able to think that far smart. because uh, he got his clout. That's what he wanted. Yeah, you know, it was it was interesting because I thought he was at least at the very least was going to show Logan like, hey, here's my TikTok. You know, like you know, let me get some pointers or something. Since you're not going to offer me a he, job, did he, he not have like a media kit or anything? Like, nah, uh, he, bro, he said he had nothing. no one. Nothing. He, no he media kit. No himself. like tablet. Nothing. Like, oh, this is like my nothing. content. This nope. is like my work. No business nothing. card. No website. Nothing. You know what he chose to do? I really he, cho he chose do. to record it. That's what he chose to do. Instead of showing somebody what it is that you have under your belt, you chose to press the record button. 
on your phone while he was asking for him for a job. Like, I don't I don't think he understands just how like insane that moment would have been for him if he had just like prepared a little like a media kit like have a like i have a tablet Something. like oh here's my media kit here's my website here's my 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 analytics for all of the stuff that i do like bro like he could have really chopped it up and logan paul could have been like you know what bro like you're showing me a lot of cool stuff Let me, you know what well we'll do we'll do like a, a like a sponsorship i'll sponsor you a little and then if you do well then i'll pick you up like shit like that but nah it's like i could already tell people who actually want to work for logan be like that was wasted like if that was me i i would have done well if that was me man me and my buddy jimmy because you thinking about opportunity and he just thinking so of, what you're like, telling yes. me being white isn't enough to get a job for logan <clears throat> paul oh my god i guess so wow i guess i mean and then the man learned being white wasn't enough wasn't enough that's it yeah. i mean it was still enough for him to get out of that whole uh Japanese suicide forest thing, but whatever. Man, I that forgot about that. I yeah, forgot dude, no, he did people that. forget that shit happened. <laughs> yeah, no, I'll never forget that shit. Because I, I was like, I, wow, wow, you got away with that. Wow. He really did, yeah. yeah. I mean, as long know. as you have a big enough following, you can get away with anything. Basically, yeah, because I mean, honestly, you truly do become uncancelable. Pretty much. Like, there's only so much that you... I mean, unless people are physically attacking you. I mean, that's the only time. That's Bro, the only even, time I think... Canceling's not, not even, like, a thing, though. Like, it doesn't even exist. You just wait enough time and you'll be all right. Either that or Pretty just, much. like, keep doing whatever you want. Like, people... Oh, let's cancel this guy. It's like, you're just promoting him at that point. Like, you're promoting his shit so people with that mindset can just find it easier. The best way is just to not say shit. Just ignore it. Yeah, I agree. I'm about to do that. You think I can get big enough doing that shit? Oh, bro, just keep doing dumb shit, be, and you'll blow up for some stupid fucking reason. Look at the crate challenge, <laughs> bro. I'd be lying if I said I didn't want to try it. <laughs> bro, I looked at this and I was like, "Why does it look like the hood guys are doing all this shit, bro?" Because we have the most fun. Yeah. I was like, where are y'all getting these milk crates, bro? What the fuck? Walmart. Yeah, they, they were selling wow. them for like a yeah. second when the show was popular. Mm -hmm. Walmart, you know, Walmart getting on it then. Walmart, yeah, Walmart know how to take advantage of an opportunity. Shit. Walmart is ghetto it. themselves. I saw yeah. that. I was like, that looks dumb as fuck. It looked Walmart like Walmart don't even answer the phone when I call. It looked like setting so. up your own obstacle. <laughs> like, no, setting up your dog. own obstacle course in a parking lot. I saw Come a man, on, man do a flip and land on his back. I was like, he dead. He died. <laughs> right there. <laughs> there are doctors watching on TikTok, just scrolling through, and just like, "Ooh, I'm gonna make me some money this summer." <laughs> yes, sir. Let me send this man a DM. <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> uh, Here, Mr. Johnson, Johnson I saw you Hello. fell. <laughs> <laughs> I you found wanna, you on TikTok. Let me give you a discount. If 10%. you want to continue to blow her back out, give me a call. <laughs> we can get this yeah. fixed up right away for you. Here's my website. <laughs> you blew your back out. Mm. Here's an extension number for my office. <laughs> I heard you let an inanimate object blow your back out. <laughs> Not a problem. We can fix that. <laughs> See, you blew your back out. Couldn't be me. It couldn't Bye. be me. <laughs> I saw there was there were people making fun of this guy in uh, in the comments, and they were saying, "Is this his supervillain origin story?" Oh my god. <laughs> this is what Syndra must have felt like when Mr. Incredible told him no. <laughs> Stop! <laughs> oh my god. I, I love those posts. I just fucking couldn't. There was one with him and he was just like about to cry in the car and they showed a picture comparison when uh, when Syndra was talking to uh, yeah. uh, Mr. Incredible and he was like <laughs> he had his face all fucked up. <laughs> oh my god, man. God. He's... This is probably some. I feel like a person who really had to like struggle through creating content probably would have made the best of this opportunity to to have like a an elevator pitch directly to Logan Paul, a person who could probably help make or break your entertainment career just by word of mouth alone, and to just have nothing to say in a span of what three minutes. Yikes! I just yeah, just just yikes. I can't. Which there man, was one least, thing he wasn't lying he about. He wasn't good enough. 
Yeah, the least he could have lied about was like, I have ambition. I have shit. That's it. That's all you had to say. He might have. But then he gonna ask to see it. He gonna ask to see it too. Like, can you show me? And the way, and the way he could have like asked him to like see how he how he's serious about all of this. He could have hired him on as an intern. He could have at least gotten an internship with him. But you would still have to show him. Like, why should I even give you that? But at least then. Even if you feel like, okay, I might not be enough compared to, like, what they're expecting. But at least in my mind, I know, okay, I can at least try. I can at least do oh, what okay. I'm capable of. No. See, that's a, that's, yeah, that's I don't know about that. About you know what? I was telling Play, he should have offered that man some head. That's what he should have said. Yeah. He should have said, bro, or I will give you the best. Me, I'll give you that clock, clock. Yes, sir. As soon as he you probably would have took it. Mm-hmm. As soon as you leave this video, you. sir, I know you're gonna need some. You got all these homies around you, <clears throat> but let's be honest. Look me dead in my eyes. Who gonna, <laughs> gonna suck your dick after this show? Who is gonna give you some top, the top of the tip, top of the tier? Listen, I'm okay? a man. I know, I know how to please a man, he said, sir. He said what? Yeah, listen, if you really wanted a job, <laughs> you really wanted a job. <laughs> you better offer that man something he can't get somewhere else. What did he say? <laughs> Did this man, what it, hey, Jesus. y'all, did this man just offer me some top? Did he just offer me some head in the parking lot after this event is over? Lo- Logan, Logan would have been like, you know what? Get the fuck out of my face. And then be like, here's come, my car. Come back after the show. Here's my car. Come back when the camera's not on. Okay, this shit, this shit is ridiculous because I, you could have literally said anything rock, rock. and just would have been like, okay. For real, for real, you're not fucking around with me? You know, for real. Yeah, your head game fire, right? Here's, you know what? You know yeah. Man, get his card now. Here's my personal numbers. That's the Tell least you could have did. You know, just say, hey, I'm good at <laughs> insert thing here. What are you good at? What are your skills? I can't argue with a man trying to tell me he gives good top. Because at that point, now I have to process it. If I'm Logan, I have to process it. Uh, Is this uh, man it, joking? It, it... <laughs> Or can he really suck a dick? Can It'll be really... better because yeah. <laughs> Logan would be thinking about it. He'd be like, nah. And then he'll get like a fucking like a big ass hot dog and just be like and just swallow the whole thing. Be like, yeah. I'm not lying. You gotta respect this, it. Yeah, this man might not I be mean, even it. then, even if like from a comedic this might, standpoint, this man might be the right choice for the squad. That's even a funny joke. You know Yeah, what I mean? from a comedic standpoint, yeah. That's he he would have been like, okay, you he you funny. Me, he told me. He could have been like, I have no talents, but I could suck the shit out of a dick. Bruh, if he would have made Logan Paul laugh, I bet yeah. you that would have been I, it. Yeah. And mm-hmm. he said, I could suck a mean dick, Mr. Paul. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck it out. Here's my resume. <laughs> my dick sucking resume. <laughs> if you would like to see some testimonials, I have them on my TikTok and Instagram. That is call sick. call any of that these numbers. Sick. They'll tell you. Call any, of these <laughs> any of these numbers. Anybody on this list, okay? All right. If you want, if you see a star next to somebody's name in my phone, that's right. That's a good testimonial. Then hand him the phone and it says "Dad" and it's got three stars next to it. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> Yo. I thought that this boy sick. well. <laughs> yeah, that is sick. I think it. I think my meeting. Hold on. I think my meeting went well with Logan Paul. I think I got the job, Dad. Bro. <laughs> show him that thing I taught you. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You show him the grapefruit twist, right? technique. The grapefruit technique. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all are sick. Oh, man. But I'm serious, oh, man. Listen, you you want a new job? You got to do what you got to do, He either would have laughed or he would have been like, listen, give me a call. To be bold enough to, to, <clears throat> to sneak into Logan Paul's event, already got to have some balls. You know what I mean? So you might as well empty that man. That's all I'm saying. Give him something he can't get somewhere else. Exactly. Genuine top. So. (laughs) (laughs) That's super soaker shit. You can't get that nowhere else. You really can't. And I really think (laughs) he could have really just told him, listen, Mr. Paul, only a man can please a man properly. <laughs> he would have been like, "What are you talking about?" Dead in you know what face. I'm talking about, sir. <laughs> because I mean, listen, the saying is, sometimes you gotta suck a little dick, bro, to get where you want to go. You have to. What? You absolutely. Wait, have wait a minute. To. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. That at that point, then it becomes misogynistic. True. 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 Wait. Huh? Hold on. How so? 
I, I really was just agreeing with him because I was like, ah, a comment about misogyny. I wasn't really paying like attention, attention, but I I'm can like, tell, dog. Uh, I'm surprised you you agree with that. Uh, no, I don't. I don't. Uh, you were just uh, three time, three head nods. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I, I was, was just you, <laughs> not too long. <laughs> but you said it. You said it. I hey, trusted listen. your word. Hey, listen, man. I may have meant it. I may may not. But I didn't agree with it. But she, uh, I don't even know. I don't know what's going on. I don't. Uh, DJ, how would you have asked Logan Paul for a job? Not like that. Not like that, huh? You know, not like that. Mm -mm. Would mm -mm. you have done it how I how I said, like, uh, show him like all the stuff that you're doing, your analytics, all that shit. Like, try to be. I probably. About it? Yeah, I probably would have. Uh, I probably would have showed you him. You touched his ass a little, right? No. Uh, no, Damn. cause then, then <laughs> no. he might have me thrown out the event at that point. Then it's like, Damn. what? What did I even? What well, I? You what already you getting thrown out anyway. For that? You getting? Yeah, no, you black. You yeah, but then out. I'm like, I'm throwing. I'm gonna get thrown out quicker, stage, bro. Who let this? Man I'm gonna get. Here? I'm gonna get thrown out quicker, bro. You try to tuck some cheeks. Oh my god. Yo, listen. I just said sexual assault. That is a case. I would have been like, exactly. That's a case. That's a case. Then you would have been like, sorry, sir. Ass. As big as that, I had to touch it. Lil Nas X told me to what? do it, sir. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah, you you lost me. This man is sick. You lost me. Yeah. Nah, for real. He should have been uh, even show him like whatever. What job was he doing? Man, ain't show him nothing from the job. Bro, he should what just, was he doing at that job like said, that he got paid a hundred thousand? And fucking like analytics website, go fucking all in, bro. I'm telling you a hundred thousand, he was giving top up at the office. I promise Damn. you, he was given top at okay. mm. that gog gog. Okay, that gog -gog. yes, sir. For a hundred k. For a hundred k. That's it. What else? Jeez. What else could he be doing at twenty two years old? You ain't got no skills. You Evidently, just... he has told us he has no skills. Yeah, he said he don't have no skills. No <laughs> How did you get this hundred thousand dollar job? I really think this man needs to give a TED talk now. Now that I think about it, mm. I really think I need to know how is this man, 22 years old, no friends, no connections, no nothing, making $100,000 a year. That's what I need to know. The perfect low job wasn't. of a TED Talk. And he wasn't. <laughs> Give it top. How did, now, has he done anything since this incident? Or is he just... Probably uh, he's top. made he's made jokes about it on his own TikTok where like, Bro, well, like I mentioned, he made... Get out of that. Yeah, yeah, he made he made a shirt where it's like, oh, can I have a job, Logan Paul? I'm like that's all it says on there. Yeah. In multiple shirts, bro. That and people scenario. buying that. Yeah, people are definitely buying it, bro. It's a meme. Bro, you'd be surprised what people buy. No, I wouldn't. Mm. No, I wouldn't. You wouldn't. I. You wouldn't. Did summer 2017, 2018. Did we not watch an entire herd of gamer boys buy bath water from a woman? That's very true. That is very <clears throat> true. That's, That's very true. true. I you forgot about I mean? that. I don't think I would be surprised. How can you I forget forgot about, about that? that. Mm -mm. Ain't no way. I don't know. So, but... Didn't someone get fucking herpes from that shit? He lied. It wasn't him. He already had herpes. Damn. Yeah. Yeah. Then he tried to blame um, he tried to blame a celebrity. So, I get it. I get it. You know, you just want to come up. But I don't <clears> know, man. I couldn't I couldn't walk into yeah. a situation where somebody was had the chance to give me an opportunity and not do everything short of sucking dick. That's good. It yeah, it me. just, it just, like, it felt disrespectful to watch. It did. It did. Mm. Seeing somebody like, who you... doesn't do anything, just, yeah. you know. I have no skills. Why are you here? How did you even, I, obviously, I the mean, moment, even if he said, the moment I'm going to sneak the... it in places. He should have said the that. Moment, the moment he say, say, he would have said, oh, I don't have any skills. Get this kid out of here, then. I don't, who the fuck am I wasting my time with you? Yeah, security didn't stop you. How the fuck did you get in here? Like, oh my god! Nothing. Like, even if you said like, "Oh, I know how to edit videos and all this," it's like in in our space, that's not anything new. Like, we all do that. Like, what makes you you? Yeah. Do you at least do you at least have like fucking funny shit? Are you viral? Like, what what makes you like? Why 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 should I give a shit? Give me give me give me one good reason why I should hire you off the top of his head. In the span of two minutes, it had off the top. <laughs> this man is sick off the top. Oh my god! All right, well, that's enough about uh talking about sucking dick. Speaking of sick individuals, um, let's go ahead and talk about you know 
this Blizzard Activision situation real quick, and then we're going to go ahead and wrap this up. Um, so McCree is getting a name change in Overwatch. Um, <clears throat> I personally uh, agree with the name change. I think it, they're changing his name to uh, Joel McSomething. Hold on, I got to find it. Uh, McDonald? Joel, no, not McDonald. Uh, uh, McBride? Mc, no, not McBride. Okay, hold on. Give me a second. I gotta, Fury? Joel McCloud. That's what it is. McConnor was going to be my my next McC guess. There's something I was close. People. There's something wrong with McCloud? y'all. McCloud? Yes, like Joel Fox McCloud. McCloud. Uh, like Fox McCloud. Exactly. Yeah, that's uh, what the name is rumored to be because a lot of information on early concept of Overwatch had Joel McCloud as... So as the name. I'm not so, mad at that. Yeah, I'm not I'm not So instead of either. McCree, it's McCloud. Yes, sir. Yeah. I mean I, he's named after a rapist. So we should probably definitely change Agreed. the name. You know? Agree. Even if it's just cowboy man. I oh think no, I'm just I'm more I'm cowboy more man. questioning like we should have gone for like a really cowboy name, not McCloud. What name would you have? Because Jesse McCree sounded very cowboy esque. Fuck yeah, it did. Um, so, I think they should have put some. They should have put a, <clears throat> a Flint Eastwood. Flint Eastwood. Ooh, Flint Eastwood. Yes, sir. Because he out here finessing. <laughs> I mean, McCree, I could see McCloud working though. Like I could see it. I could, car I could see from it. from Cars. Lightning uh, McQueen. McQueen. That's the first thing I thought of. I'm like, McQueen, dog? That's the, fir that's the first thing I think of when I hear McCloud. Like, the car. The red one. Ka-chow! Lightning McQueen. <laughs> that's, yes, sir. Yeah. that's the first thing I think of. Joel McChow. McChow. Does he have... Are they changing? Like, they just changing the name? They're Ain't nothing the bottom will change? Yeah. Or just the name? Nothing else is going to yeah. change. They'll probably have to go through the thousands of voice lines that they have where somebody has said McCree. Um... I don't think that's gonna, a lot. It is. It is because every character has at least two to three lines. Um, and it, the game's been out <laughs> six years. So that's mm -hmm. like every season there's new interactions oh, with ton each of character. Voice lines. So every yeah. single person this is going to be expensive. Between this and the oh, lawsuit, yeah. like just changing the voice lines in general, unless they it's just not decide even, not to. Like it's gonna it's be not expensive. even the voice lines because it's the spray tags as well. Yeah, I, every Some spray of them has tag, a name in it. Yeah, every spray tag has to be changed. Um, what do you do about the Overwatch cinematics? What do you do about going forward? Like, do you just not acknowledge that in three different I cinematics? I forgot about the cinematics. Names? Yeah, <laughs> like, come on now. You gotta, and now we're for sure, for sure, not gonna get that Disney Pixar deal. It's just not oh, gonna yeah. happen. We're not gonna get the Overwatch movie now. So, do you think they really delete those or anything from like do they expunge those from the internet like those videos with McCree on? Them? No, or like when no, they no, say there's people, there's like people that. that have they, videos, that I would, still have videos of it. Yeah, that would be a waste of time. They're just going to going forward acknowledge that his name is now <clears throat> Joel. No, I mean, no, I mean, uh, theirs like they're on their on their uh, oh, on like theirs, oh, theirs yeah, yeah, they're probably gonna erase their shit. They're, yeah, they're probably gonna erase. I don't, I don't, they're probably gonna, gonna erase like, all of their. All of anything that has McCree in it, there's probably going to be like interns going through each video and just and be changing, like, all right, we need to erase yeah, this. As far uh, as text, like yeah. tag all the videos, and then they'll probably have to remake those videos so that way they don't lose it. It, it depends on how. I guess it I depends it, on the, the rollout. How of important it. it is. Yeah, because that's a lot of resources. Remaking could, it. Yeah. Otherwise, they could just ignore it and it's just like, hey, that was that, and acknowledge that. There's a, his name is now Joel McLeod going forward, and every I think single, that's what they do. Yeah, every single document and cinematic going forward, and just ignore all that other stuff, and then you know. Well, it's like that's cool, <clears throat> like changing a character's name. Um, maybe, maybe just get better as a company. Don't shred documents, you know. Oh, no, 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 don't no, do no, shit not, like that. That's not happening. That's like. Not Hey man, that's not happening. That should never. And what's, happen. what's funny too is that, like, no, no, we'd rather waste a fuck ton of money and resources than change our ways. Uh, it's because funny. we like touching inappropriately. According to the uh, to this to the article that Tony shared, it actually is cheaper for them to pay people to shred these documents than to go forward with with the consequences of this lawsuit. Like it's. So, uh... It's fucking crazy. Like it's cheaper yeah. to do that than to pay for the lawsuit. I the only thing I'm I'm bothered <clears throat> by, right? And this is just me speaking personally. This has delayed 
the development of Overwatch because we were supposed to get the new map uh, two months ago and we were supposed to get the new character this month, which is not happening because now all of that stuff is delayed. And then Overwatch 2 was supposed to come out this season, like this upcoming fall season. And we're not yeah. getting that. So it's like, imagine all the people that you have to shift around now, all the higher ups that you have to get rid of, <laughs> the ones that are specifically named in these documents that are like, this person did this, this person did that, all the whistleblowers, all the everything. You have to solve all of that stuff before, as a company, you can come together and be like, this team is working on that, this team is working on that, these people will delegate that. You know what I mean? Like, there's just no... I, I don't see Blizzard coming back from this. I don't see Oh, them, for sure. Because right now... Unless they, they clean people, house. Like, yeah, completely. They have to, everybody would have to go. Like, everybody. Everyone's gone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I would need that, too. Scorch Earth policy. Because it's a... It's like Thanos said, as long as there is one person that remains that remember what was, we can never have what is. And I I truly believe that this company's not going back to anything. I'll be I wouldn't be surprised if they just changed the whole name and just <laughs> just became a completely different company with all the same. Hey, Jeff was ahead of the curve. Yeah, he said I'm dipping. He's exactly. seen it come. That, that, that man just said I'm out. He's... That doesn't mean anything though, because he he knew. He knew what was going on. Oh yeah, he had to. It's it's the same thing. It's the same thing with like the the oh, the other CEOs leaving to make their own company. It's like yeah, but like you knew what was going on with your company. Like your your whole your whole shit was about being rock stars, and you think oh because I'm I'm in another company, I'm gonna like it's not gonna happen again. Especially if you guys have another hitter. Yeah, yeah I don't I don't trust any like if they worked in Activision Blizzard. I'm not trusting it. I'm sorry, because you you were either a part yeah. of it or you oh didn't even God. say anything. Bro, imagine that got being that like, got way too extensive for it, people. Not imagine saying. being a, like mid level, right? Like you're not senior, you're not one of the leads or anything like that, but you're not like low tier either. And you put that you worked for Activision Blizzard for like five six years on your resume. That right? would be a stain, bro. Trying to get a job would be. So tell us, how do you how do you feel about these uh, accusations going around? And if you say one thing, they'll be like, you can leave now. If you say another, they'll be like, oh, okay. Hmm. You can still leave. We're going to have to ask you to leave. <laughs> yeah, like, especially if you, like, join a progressive company oh that, like, God, yeah, no. is pushing against this type of shit. Like, like, the funny thing is, like, I cannot imagine them working in Bungie. Because Bungie wouldn't even fucking let them in. Nah. Like they'd be like, Ubisoft yeah, no, no one from Activision, dog. Yeah, Ubisoft will take them. <laughs> oh, they, for sure. They Ubisoft got all, all kinds of That's the thing. It's like shit. they're next. The really, the really big AAA uh, producers and shit, like EA, uh, Activision, Ubisoft. Some of the dirty shit they must have, I like, yeah, because like you know EA has some fucking like skeletons in the closet. Oh, yeah, for sure. And it's a big ass closet. Yeah, for sure. They got a warehouse, bro. No, no, no. So like they got a, a warehouse. It's a it's warehouse just a matter of time house. before like the game like the gaming industry like just gets shooketh. Like AAA is gonna either start dying or more shit's just gonna start popping out. Like oh hey yeah EA it, we all know EA is like doing all that gambling shit. Mm -hmm. But imagine they start falling apart because like all all the other countries are like yeah no more no more gambling no more. I think it's all which is like some all of their profit. Already. Yeah, I, I think it's already There's bad enough countries. that, uh, you know, like the gaming industry as a whole is really like hit or miss now. You know, like they invest million, millions of dollars into like one game, right? And if that game flops, the whole studio is just like, Poof. guess what? EA is yep. buying you. You know what I mean? Like that's, yeah. that's a tough spot to be in. I mean, unless you're like Sucker Punch or Guerrilla Studios or something, somebody that's like, a part of uh this big conglomerate bethesda getting bought by xbox that's the only way you can safely make games because well that's not really getting that's, getting hitters that's like that. the that's the weight of like how many years in the in the gaming industry yeah. it's one of those like we're too big to to die like it's like when somebody thing. owns way too many pieces of property on monopoly and they see that yeah. one person struggling <laughs> and everybody just be scared of that side of the board. They be like, we do not want to fuck with that. You see hotels popping up and shit. Motherfucker making investments and shit. Uh-uh. No. No. <laughs> no. I ain't got... You be excited to go to jail. You be like, huh, three hots and a cot. Yes, sir. <laughs> do not pass go. Do not collect $200. Good. 
Bruh. I'd rather be yeah, in, a, in a fictional game getting gaming. violated. <laughs> Instead of gaming me. right now, like AAA wise, is just fucking horrid. Like, like you said, it's just such a hit or miss. Like for me, I'm having I'm having so much more of a fun time with like finding like small, small companies that are doing video games, uh, small teams that are making video games because they're making fire as fi- fucking games that are like, like even better than some AAA games because it's not like oh here's fucking monetization here's like DLCs that cost like too much fucking money. They're just like here's a game that we literally made. It's free. It's on free access, whatever it's called on Steam, uh, yeah, early access, like and we hope you like it. And the game's like, bro, like I've killed like two thousand hours in this game. What the fuck? It's like, thanks. Like it was like only thirty dollars. Like what the fuck? It's you like the same thing upset. with uh, Seven Days to Die. You actually like, get upset yeah, how fun. little money you gave them. You're like, yeah, oh, bro, man, I can't like, bro, I'm like, like let me give you a, an extra thirty dollars. I'm gonna buy it for my homie because this shit was so good. Take my money. Take my fucking but, like, money. But like. What is it? I bought, I, th- I think I've said this before, but I bought like a few months back uh, Monster Hunter Rise, Outriders, and uh, Valheim all in the same week. And the only game I kept playing was fucking Valheim. And that shit was like $30, and the other two were sixty fucking, uh, $69.99, I think. That's too much money, man. Mm-hmm. And it's like two AAA games, which I was like, I beat it. I'm fucking tired. Started playing Valheim. Literally fucking play that shit forever. Monster Hunter is too much of a. It's just. It's too grindy. It's ain't no way that game should be that grindy. Dude, I played that way. It's all about the grind. It's too grindy. That's D two slow. D two don't have less of a grind than, than Monster Hunter. Dude, D two has the... grind, bro. Yeah, D2 we can tell you didn't play. Yeah, D two. <laughs> bro, I, bro, I played. I played grind. Yeah. grind I, not shit. recently. I ain't played D two recently. Not but... recently. Are you t- like, bro? D2 Have has played this at is, all? We're going on like four or five years of it being like really, really, really grindy. Like, it's been a minute, DJ. Like, like out of the uh, box, I ain't, the I ain't. still grindy. I like, mean, they've made it better we, now, but it's still bad. We have weapons from fucking two years ago, I think, that we can still farm. People are still farming weapons from that long ago. Like, there's so much grind. Weapons, armor, getting getting the build you want grinding for an exotic like there's a lot of grind i would say there's more grind in destiny 2 only because in monster hunter all you're grinding for is weapons and armor but that's it like with destiny 2 it's different weapon rolls different armor rolls statistics on the armor itself bro there's so much into it true yeah i thought oh, really i thought like they, had, they have that in monster hunter too no, i thought that it's was not, it's not no a it's everything's drop static until, unless it's like a there's no randomness yeah unless it's like a well really, not randomness but yeah it's like you're yeah, basically like, like if you if you kill a boss like you're guaranteed to get a drop but like depending mm-hmm. on the rarity of it like oh you need like this amount in order to create like a new dragon armor or whatever you just have to play it again, and you still get the drops for everything. It's just sometimes you might get seven, sometimes you might get ten, sometimes you might get twenty, sometimes you might get. Four. And there's a way to buff that percentage. Like I think, like what is it, five percent to get like a like a jammer or whatever it's called, the really rare thing. You can actually bump that up with uh with material. Yeah, and, and, or and other I think food items too, and they make yep. it like more efficient yep. to like, uh, for certain weapons to be used against this specific enemy, and they drop. Them. There's. Yeah, there's like so many ways to do it. Not only that, in Monster Hunter World, you could actually just make it from uh, this lady that was stirring a pot. So like, there is grind in Monster Hunter. I'm not saying there isn't, but I don't think there is. It, it's at the level of Destiny too, because there's just way more weapons, like an obscene amount. Well, I just remember that differently then. So I, it's been a minute since I went back. Are you t- are you talking myself. about vanilla Destiny two? Because at that be point, like, yeah, like I probably launch. did. Pretty yeah. uh, that's because vanilla Destiny two didn't minute. have random rolls. First first and two weeks that was good, Tony. I remember because I was playing. First two weeks were fire. First two oh, weeks, first were, two weeks were fun. Oh, After that, it turned, turned into ass. They're like, what do you mean they took the ability to actually play the game out of the game? <laughs> yeah, they did static rolls on the weapons, and the game just kind of like turned boring as fuck. Yeah, I can. Because there was nothing to fucking go for. Everyone was using the same the same weapon because there was no random rolls. That's yeah. what I'm saying. Like there's so many there's so much more differences now. Uh uh-uh. I'm cool. The only game yeah. I want to play uh habitually like that is Apex Legends. That's it. So Yikes. Yeah. I mean, hey man, you know what? It's okay. It's just you know, it's for me. I don't know why, but some games just get me hooked and other games don't. And Apex is definitely one of those. I don't judge it, man. So, you know, I, I really wish Tony would give it a try now that Lil Nas X no. is in the game. 
No. <laughs> Listen, if you hate gay people, just say that. Yes. That's crazy. <laughs> he's he's thinking about the children. I'm thinking about the children. Okay. Children. I, I guess I have to respect that. I guess. <laughs> I guess I have to respect that. So, but, uh, yeah, I, I can't think of any other game that I sink tons of time into playing over and over and over again, except for Disgaea 5. Yeah. Oh, hi, Deacon. This guy was good, though. No. Sky yeah, 5 was yeah. fire, bro. That's the first this guy ever. No, no, I beat 4. Never mind. Oh. Damn, he turned the light off. He had to go readjust the lights. Um, right. Like, for me, I think, like, I have the most hours in Destiny 2 for me out of all my games. What's it? Yeah. Because uh, I think okay, I have two. You. I have 4,500 4, uh, hours. I don't think I, think I have 1,000 hours in any game. I have 1,000 in, like, maybe two games. Jessica says she's. I don't even think I should go over my siege. My C stats. PS2, about 1400 yeah. hours. Yeah. Like, mm-hmm. Fallout 4, I got 134. Like, I don't even know if that's I'm looking at my siege one. hours on one account <laughs> and I got 3500. One account. Yeah, I have four. Like, I think my second place game is like 300 hours, over a thousand less than the first one. Unfortunately, mine is uh, CSGO. Oh, real nice. gamer. Right. Yeah, that tracks. Yeah. Well, I played that for four years, so. Yeah, mine's professionally too, probably. Because uh, nah. I'm not even counting like the co- the console hours, because console was like fucking. Oh shit. god. Yeah, no, that would be tough. I think it was D1 for me for a long time. On Bro, D1 hit different. They hit yeah. different. I think mine was on. Console we go over this every year. year. Bro, right? Every year, every Did you hear that Gallahorn's coming back? Yeah, um, I was watching the event with Plank, bro. <laughs> I had no oh, right weird. watching that fucking oh, event. That shit made me laugh, bro. Ooh, that's when I stopped. I got well, my last time playing D1 was when I got Galley. That shit's gonna be busted and people are gonna be mad. This is pay to win. I'm like, yeah, you. Yeah, you it right. was back then too. Don't worry. I mean, yeah, you're right. Yes, sir. Uh, all right. Um, I think that's going to pretty much wrap it up. Anybody have anything to add? Anything they want to get off their chest for this week? Yo, question. I thought we were being here at 7.30. 7.30 EST, bitch. You should read. I don't do that. And we even started <laughs> at 8.30. Yeah, we did, actually. Yeah. yeah. We did. Gotcha. We did, because I got the time zone wrong. It was, it was set. I said. No. I just saw. Easter. Yeah, I was wrong. Yeah. So he was wrong too. Mm-hmm. I saw that slash, but I, I stopped reading after that slash. Said, yeah, that's the part that was important to you. <laughs> yeah, I saw seven. I was like, okay, Bitch, cool. you made yeah, the yeah. post. Why not put our time zone first? Why would I put our time zone first when majority of the people on the podcast aren't on our time zone? The because information is, is more headquarters important. Headquarters is to in me. California. Oh, headquarters no. is in California. Oh, no. Okay. Oh, no. <laughs> And then I also thought about who was going to read that. I said, DJ is going to have to read this. Let me put Actually, Eastern time first. Did you hear, Jay, that uh, people from Florida can't fly to LA anymore? Or California? Good. Good. So I can't go to visit anymore. Uh, that's oh, okay. well, you can we'll you drive into the next we'll, state. We'll yeah. you in. Don't worry. No, fuck just, that. Just, just drive into the next state and yeah, catch a flight it. there. That's it. We got you. We're going to pick you up. We don't even, we don't even like LAX anyway. Is that is it the inverse too? Can we not fly to Florida? I don't, I don't know. You won't be able to come. I mean, back. I'm not saying nobody want nobody wants to fly to Florida. I'm just saying, I can we not? Yeah, no. You gotta you go over just all I know, all helicopter. I know is I can't go over there. Oh well, that's. I mean, not by air. You're right there on the coast. Just take a boat, bro. <laughs> go right through <laughs> the Panama swimming, Canal. My people have done it. I didn't say swim, motherfucker. I said get in the boat, bro. bro our I'm people have done it. Like, let's do it go. Too. I don't want you including my people. We've crossed the fucking river that deep. Oh hey, God. listen, man. Your back was wet. Hop on a Bro. piece of driftwood. I did put my shoes on my head. You're right. Oh, my God. He <laughs> said his what? Oh, no. <sighs> anyway. I can truly be Hispanic. I'm, I'm so proud of you guys, man. A true test of time. Yeah. Truly. Truly. Well, we want to thank you guys for listening to this week's episode of the podcast. Uh, any, anybody have any words of wisdom? Mr. DJ, I can I can give that glass. Yes, sir. You said what? 
what the fuck did I gotta watch this week's episode? What did I miss? He <laughs> he Anyway, we want to thank the you guys. Man, for he knows how to pleasure a man. <laughs> he knows how to pleasure. Hold up, you're hearing this? I can give it. You said oh. Tony got Tony got ice in his veins. Logan Paul, please my resume. <laughs> <laughs> Please look at my dick sucking resume. Yikes. Anyway, we want to thank you guys oh, for listening to this week's episode. You can follow everybody on their social media links down below, and we will catch you on next week's episode. Make sure to keep it canon. Did that say thanks for sucking for a second, Blank? <laughs>